As co-chair of the Senate Taiwan Caucus, I'm incredibly proud to wish the Taiwan Relations Act a very happy anniversary. Our two countries are bound by shared interests and values, namely our commitments to democracy, human rights, the rule of law, and free enterprise. We, we appreciate that freedom, security, and the exchanges of ideas, of goods and services are, are keys not only to a prosperous United States and a prosperous Taiwan, but uh, the, the Indo-Pacific region and a prosperous world. I look forward to working with you to build on our legacy, to increase our economic ties, improve our collective security, and strengthen the abiding friendship and partnership between our peoples. Taiwan is and always will be one of our most important partners in the region. So I say happy 40th anniversary to the Taiwan Relations Act. I'm looking forward to many more in the future. Hi, I'm Senator Bob Menendez of New Jersey. As a longtime co-chair of the Senate Taiwan Caucus and friend of the people of Taiwan, I want to join you in celebrating the 40th anniversary of the Taiwan Relations Act. The Taiwan Relations Act has been foundational for the United States and Taiwan and has benefited our two peoples in the entire region for the past four decades. The American people and the people of Taiwan share an enduring friendship and an unshakable common interests and common values, including a profound respect for democracy, free markets, the rule of law, and human rights. I'm so glad to join in celebrating the 40th anniversary of the Taiwan Relations Act, what we call the TRA. In 1979, the U.S. Congress passed this unprecedented legislation ensuring that Taiwan's security and the U.S.-Taiwan relationship would endure and prosper. The Taiwan Relations Act is evidence of the deep support for Taiwan in the United States Congress. America's commitment to Taiwan is based first and foremost in our shared values of democracy and human rights. Four decades later, the TRA, along with the six assurances, still form the bedrock of the relationship between our two countries. Taiwan has become a democratic, prosperous, and generous partner in the Pacific and beyond. I am grateful for the friendship of the people of Taiwan. As chairman of the House Foreign Affairs Committee, I look forward to continuing to strengthen and deepen the U.S.-Taiwan relationship, and thumbs up for that relationship. As a lead Republican on the House Foreign Affairs Committee, I want to congratulate you on the 40th anniversary of the Taiwan Relations Act. China has never been more aggressive, and Taiwan stands as our ally against that aggression and oppression. I want to let you know that you have a friend in Congress. Hello, I'm Congressman Brad Sherman from California's best named city, Sherman Oaks. I currently serve as the chairman of the House Asia Subcommittee. This year marks the 40th anniversary of the Taiwan Relations Act but it's not enough to simply mark this milestone. We need to reaffirm our commitment to the six assurances and increase our engagement with Taiwan. As the lead Democrat on the Taiwan Travel Act, which was signed into law last year, I had the pleasure of recently of hosting President Tsai in Los Angeles. More Taiwanese leaders should visit the United States and more American leaders should visit Taiwan, as I have. We need to ensure the Taiwan Travel Act is fully implemented and use it as the basis to build even deeper ties. Taiwan cannot be a bargaining chip. Thank you and I look forward to defending the U.S.-Taiwan relationship in the Asia Subcommittee. Everybody, this is Congressman Ted Yoho. We're here at the Capitol. Uh, I know you guys are at the Twin Oaks Estate honoring Tecro and the 40th anniversary of the TRA, the Taiwanese Relations Act. This is something we're very proud of. We're proud of our relationships with you. Look forward to the day that you're recognized around the world as an independent Taiwanese nation. Hi, I'm Mario diaz Villar. As one of the co-chairmen of the Taiwan Caucus, I'm proud of the efforts of the work that we've done to strengthen the relationships between our two countries. The Taiwan Relations Act, that is the cornerstone of our relationship of our friendship. And on the 40th anniversary, we celebrate and remember the things that bind us, the values that bind us, 
freedom, democracy, human rights. I'm Jerry Connolly, and I am the co-chair of the Taiwan Caucus here in the United States Congress. This is an important year because we're celebrating a landmark piece of legislation that governs the bilateral relationship between Taiwan and the United States, and that is, of course, the Taiwan Relations Act. It's important for many reasons. It uh, circumscribes our relationship, but it also sends a message to those who might want to do damage to Taiwan that uh, the United States is going to be there to provide defense for Taiwan and for Taiwan's democracy. Uh, and so Congress helped write that bill. It was a, also a pivotal moment in terms of Congress reasserting itself in, uh, in the writing of foreign policy, and in this case, a very critical piece of foreign policy. So we have a lot to celebrate this year, and uh, it's the year of the pig uh, as well, and we're celebrating Chinese Lunar New Year. 40 years ago, President Carter signed the Taiwan Relations Act into law, ushering an age of partnership between Taiwan and the United States. This relationship has benefited the global community and is critical to prosperity in the region as the TRA has facilitated decades of successful bilateral economic security and trade relations. As a co-chair of the Congressional Taiwan Caucus, I would like to commemorate this important milestone and welcome future diplomatic efforts and partnerships between our nations. I'm Steve Shabbat, a longtime friend of Taiwan. I'm one of the founding members and now co-chairman of the Congressional Taiwan Caucus. Uh, the U.S.-Taiwan relations uh, goes back a long time and it's very, very important to both countries. Um, Taiwan is one of our key allies, one of our greatest trading partners, uh, and just a tremendous friend. Uh, they stand for democracy. They're really a role model for democracy. Uh, and I just want to say uh, we're so happy, we want to celebrate uh, the 40th anniversary of the Taiwan Relations Act, and so U.S.-Taiwan Relations Act.